Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I was not available for last two months, I guess, and I haven't made any video uh, in last two months. Sorry for that. Now I am available. I am in my college, and I'll be making videos on different topics of data science and uh, college-related stuffs. So, guys, in this video, I'll talk about my experience, how I got offer from three places for my summer internship after my second year. One was from IIT Mandi and two are from uh, corporate companies. One is Milopal and another one is uh, Eloent. So guys, in this video, I'll explain how I got uh, internship offered from three places after my second year. So if you want to know how to get internship easily and how to get internship in uh, second year of your college or third year of your college, please watch my whole video. So guys, basically there are four secrets. There are mainly four secrets for getting an internship anywhere. First one is just keep applying. Just keep applying, applying to many companies as many you want. And second one is your resume. Third one is a cover letter. And final one is any reference if you have or it's just optional. If you have reference, then it's good for you. Otherwise, it doesn't matter. It sometimes important but it doesn't necessary for getting an internship so there are mainly four uh, uh, secrets for getting an internship first one is keep applying second one is your resume third one is your cover letter and final one is your reference we will talk about detail for all these uh, secrets one by one so let's start about how to keep applying so guys keep applying is the basic funda of getting an internship you have to keep applying till you haven't got any offer from any companies or any IITs. Just don't bother about your rejection rate. Don't think, I mean, just keep applying. I, I, I want to say that uh, if you have applied to 10 companies, let's assume you, you have applied to 10 companies and you got offer from no one, then your rejection rate will be zero. Now let us suppose you applied for 100 companies then it is 100% sure any one of them will offer you then it will uh, it will have 1% selection rate and believe me guys this 1% will make you champion this 1% make you stand out of your class so you just keep applying you don't bother about um, you are getting selected or not uh, any one of the companies is not offering you they are not texting you back so don't worry about this stuff your task your main funda will be just keep applying to the companies and mainly if you are, you are in the second year of your college just uh, target the startups don't go for the established companies because they want some uh, real assets i mean they want some uh, real valued employee so that they can work um, better. So if you are in second year of your college, just go for the startups. I mean, you are from India, then go for Bangalore, uh, startups in Bangalore and startups in Noida or Delhi. So it will help. I mean, you have a great chance in getting an offer from an startup. And guys, believe me, getting an internship uh, from your second year, I mean, after your second year is not an easy task, you know. You have to work hard on your, on your skills, on, on your resume to get a better internship after the second year. So after completing, after making your skill better, just apply to the startups, uh, apply to the companies. And if you don't get any response from them, just don't worry about that. Their task is to <laughs> don't respond and your task is to just keep applying. So you just keep applying. Now you are with me to this place. I mean, you are listening me uh, from the last two minutes. You have, you must have a question where to apply, which pl platform to use. So guys, I'll tell you our, uh, about the uh, different platforms uh, on which you can apply for the internship like Angel List and uh, intern sala and there are so many i'll make uh, a separate video on where to apply where to get an internship so uh, i mean to say if i tell you everything in this video then this video will get so large and main funda of this video will mislead now second comes your resume guys you must know your resume rep represents yourself to any hr of the company i mean put every important detail about yourself, about your skills, about your experience, about your projects on the 
resume don't put any unnecessary details uh, on the resume it will make a resume very filled but it will not help you the hr of any company i mean who is hiring will only see your uh, skills he will see your uh, he or she will see your experience or any project you have done so don't put any extra stuff on your resume it will not help you for sure now there are mainly three things to worry about on your uh, i mean resume first one is your skill second one is your uh, experience and third one is your project if you have done, done any project in past time now talking about the skills guys before applying to any company before apply to any of the universities for research internship just make your skill very very you i mean uh, you can say learn everything perfectly i mean to say before applying to any company know their uh, requirements i mean if uh, if you are applying to any uh, company based on ai then you must know uh, about ml deep learning then you should apply so first make uh, make your skills then do some projects regarding that skill i mean to say if you are uh, doing some uh, doing some work on your skill i mean you are doing machine learning then do a project related to that skill and mention that project on your resume that you have this skill and you uh, have worked on this skill and plus this project and uh, during the hiring process they will ask you about that project how you worked on this how many uh, i mean if there is any colleague uh, related to i mean you have uh, worked on that project uh, yourself or there were a team so uh, you have uh, to clear your mind about that project i mean they will ask each and every question about that project so um, enhance your skills and i would say uh, make some projects reg regarding that skill it will help you in the hiring process now there comes uh, experience uh, section also if you have any experience i mean you have done any internship you are in second year uh, third year of your college and you are applying for some internship after the third year then you must uh, if you have any experience i mean you have any past experience of any internship or anything so mention it you have worked here from this date to this date and it will help you for sure i mean uh, if they will see if you have works a work, work experience in some uh, i mean some domain then it will help you to uh, and uh, they also cause they will uh, see uh, yeah this uh, this person know this uh, things very well cause he has been working on this uh, domain for two months or uh, any period of time then it will help you uh, in uh, getting hired to any internship or any company guys if you want to know how to write a perfect resume then please comment down below i'll make a separate video on that how to write a perfect uh, resume what will be the perfect format to write a perfect resume and to get hired please comment down below i'll make a separate video for that because uh, uh, telling everything in the same video will make this um, uh, video not so clear about its aim so guys the, uh, the next one is writing a cover letter a perfect cover letter to some of the companies i mean to say some of the companies or some of the foreign companies i guess asks for a cover letter cover letter contains who are you and why you are you are choosing this the same uh, i mean same company for internship and some of the iits i guess they ask for some cover letter uh, you can see yeah they ask for some cover letter and you have to write the cover letter who you are what are your skill sets and why you are applying for this project i mean uh, if the project is under some professors then you have to mention why you are applying for this project why you, you are interested in this project so you have to write some uh, cover letter i mean this cover letter helps you to get internship easily because they read that cover letter and they came to know yeah this person is very interested in this domain and he or she is uh, interested in this project and he wants to work on this project and this uh, this uh, helps quite a time uh, in getting internship so uh, you must write your uh, cover letter so um, perfect i mean if you want to know how to write a cover letter i have written cover letter for two or three companies so if you want to know how to write a cover letter please comment down below i'll make a separate video on how to write a perfect resume and how to write a perfect cover letter to get hired and guys the last one is your reference if you have some reference 
if uh, your professor can refer you to some IITs or some companies, then it will help you in getting uh, internship uh, out there. But this is not, this is not so, uh, I mean, uh, important. This is just optional. If you have some uh, reference, then go for it. Uh, it will help you for sure. Um, I mean, it will help you, but it is optional. If you don't have any reference, then don't worry. I got uh, an offer from two uh, of the corporate companies, uh, Hello and Envelopal, but I was not having any reference to that companies, but I uh, got an uh, internship offer from them. So, Reference is optional. Don't keep in mind that I don't, I don't have any reference. I, how, how, how can I get internship from uh, any company? So reference is optional. Keep in mind. And if you have any reference, use it. I mean to say, use it for yourself. It will help you in getting uh, internships out there. So guys, this was a short video. I mean, this was, I guess, 10 minutes video on how I got an internship. Uh, three offers from one from IIT and two from corporate companies and this was a short video I you can see uh, how can someone get internship after he, his or her uh, second year if you have any query about uh, internship getting internship and what are the different portals where you can apply for the internship comment down below I'll help you I'll help you how to apply how to write a cover letter how to write your resume how to enhance your skills if you have any problems related to your career uh, just comment down below i'll help you because um, i am a college student i'm doing my btech and i know what are the problems um, guys face during their college so this was a short video and we will meet soon i'll be making so many videos uh, in coming days uh, lastly last two months i was not uh, i mean I was busy in my internship so I couldn't make any video and I'll share some more steps about my internship how what was the purpose of my internship what I have done there and in which domain my internship was if you are interested to know comment down below and this is the secret to I got an um, offer from three places IIT and two corporate companies and which domain I choose, which uh, I choose either IIT or two of the companies, <laughs> it's just a secret. If you want to know, comment down below and I'll share why you choose uh, one of three and I'll tell you which one I choose and chosen and I'll share my experience about my internship, what I have done there and what was the project and actually it was quite interesting and I enjoyed my two months of internship. So I'll share my experience to you guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.